this is one of those cupboard ingredients which is so helpful you know you just take it out and you've got a meal you know mix it with boiling water you've got a soup hi guys how you all doing welcome to Backyard Chef I'm Rick today we are going to make the cream powder that is in all the cream of anything soups now I normally make a big jar of this and shove it in the cupboard I use it regular away but I've run out so we're going to basically knock up the cream of anything powder which you can use to cream of anything any soup it is dead easy to make guys so let's show you how to do it right in here guys that is one cup of milk powder now I'm using whole milk milk powder you know it's a bit creamy and it gives that really creamy um, taste throughout your soup but you can use any milk powder okay so in here then we've got one cup of milk powder and what we need to be doing we need to be adding some corn flour so we're going to add about five tablespoons of corn flour now the corn flour is the thickener that's going to thicken the soup and it's in all the powdered soup mixes three four five so there we have we have five tablespoons of corn flour right so then this guys if you wanted to make a vegetarian version you would actually use a vegetarian bouillon powder but i'm using chicken bouillon powder because you know i like that flavor through everything and i'm i'm not really a veggie i like veg food but i'm not a veggie so what we're going to do, we're going to add two tablespoons of this bouillon powder. So we'll get that in there. And then what we want to do again is we want to add two teaspoons of onion powder. Now you can use onion flakes if you want, grind them up, whatever. So that's our two teaspoons of onion powder. We want to be putting a little bit of a veggie flavour through there, you know. We want about half a teaspoon of dried thyme and we want a couple of teaspoons of dried parsley. Now obviously we're making a dried mix guys so don't be using fresh parsley. You can top it off in your soup if you so wish but not in this mix. And then what we want to do we want to put a little bit of a peppery taste in there. So we're going to put in about half a teaspoon of pepper. I'm not putting salt in because if you taste your bouillon powder, your chicken bouillon or, or even vegetable, it might be salty. So we can add salt but we can't take it away. So all we need to do now is give this a good mix. So mix it all up. This smells fantastic actually guys. And that's it. It's as simple as that, that is so easy, you know, and that's ready ready to use any time. Store it in an airtight container or in a bag sealed up and you've got perfect cream of anything soup mixture to go any time. Really, really easy. So that's it guys, all we need to do is store that in an airtight container. It's as simple as that. So that's it guys, if you find it helpful don't forget smash that like and subscribe, share with your friends, all that kind of stuff. Catch you in the next video.